bread pudding with a whiskey cream sauce. Welcome to our kitchen out here in Mother Nature's great outdoors it is. My name is Kent Rollins and I'm from Hollis, Oklahoma. And welcome to what? 1876 Studebaker chuck wagon that we cook off of. Whole lot different than what you might see on the movie set or some of them deals. We feed three meals a day to cruise in any kind of weather. So I got everything in my kitchen that you probably have in yours, except all the electrical parts. I don't have none of them, but we won't need them. And the dish we're preparing today, a cowboy favorite and one that graces our table nearly every holiday. What is that? Bread pudding with a whiskey cream sauce you got to have some really good bread to start out with and I have done a lot of experimentation through the years and what is it hamburger bun so fluffy because there's a lot of air in there but we're gonna start with what some cow juice we are do you not call it cow juice Rachel that's what it is here most of the time next hen fruit rooster bellets so go ahead and put three in there and get that mixed up really well make sure they are smooth ready to go everything is incorporated well about a cup and a half of just white sugar. Give that another stir. While we was just sitting over there not doing nothing, we melted some butter on our old wood stove. Bertha, we did. It's about a stick. And make sure your butter is not really hot when you do this because you don't want it to set them eggs. A little bit of cinnamon, some nutmeg, vanilla. Give it another stir. It is time to add the bread it is. Now, you need to tear these off in bite-sized pieces so it usually takes eight to 10 hamburger buns, but we used accordingly. And you'll see that culinary here, Rachel, and I know you love pups. They are always here to do a good job, they are. You just wanna fold this over to where you can keep that bread sorta of in its shape and it'll keep its form. You can see that consistency. It's not soup, it is a pudding. Now, a lot of y'all would probably be cooking this in the oven, right? I don't see one out here anywhere I don't. So. We're gonna put it in a Dutch oven and we're gonna bake it with some wood coals. So you need to preheat your oven to about 350. I'm gonna drag right out here. Make sure that your vessel that you're cooking in this has been greased already. Just get her mashed around there just right. Put a lid on it. Meet you right over here where we're gonna bake it. Well, the bread pudding is cooking and what are we talking about now? Some of my whiskey cream sauce. So we got a stick of butter in there, cup of sugar, mixed well heavy cream once again stir now it says whiskey cream but i don't want you to just go get some old plastic bottle whiskey that's ain't got no flavor to it i want you to get the good stuff give it a stir we're gonna let this come to a good bowl but be careful and not scorch that cream just let it come to a gentle simmer it'll be ready to go over that pudding here in just a minute Rachel, ain't that pretty? I'll be ready to dive in. And I know, Rachel, you have probably done this too, sugar. We got to feed the culinary helpers we do here. Everybody needs some. There's Sade. Everybody's going to get a bite. There comes a time in your life when you get to reap the rewards in which you sowed. That stuff is so good, make you go to town dance every Saturday night, even on Friday. Mm -mm. 